Gina Palace here with Home Buddies. If you have a rib cage that sits a little bit wider, this is going to be a great exercise for you. It's called the rib smash. You're going to need a yoke block for the exercise. It's good to have something to rest your head on, like a foam roller. You will be lying on your side with your legs bent 90 degrees and the block goes right underneath your ribs. Okay, so that's there. Then your head is supported so that it's neutral. We're going to have the knees bent up in front of our hips with our legs bent 90 degrees. And you'll see that my lower legs are also 90 degrees from my upper legs. From here, what we're going to do is take the top side arm and reach it long. Breathing in, breathing out, and reaching. You don't want your rib cage to flop forward too, too much. A little bit's okay. But what we're really trying to do is stretch out your scapula on your back and not actually move your torso a lot. So breathing in again, breathing out, allow that block to press your rib up. Breathing in again, and out, and reach. So you can expect for this to feel a little bit uncomfortable. You certainly don't want to cause sharp pain in your ribs. And if you have osteoporosis or osteopenia, then this is not the best exercise for you because your ribs are going to be a little bit more fragile.